in here beside the Titanic Studios and the Belfast, the new Belfast Great Light or Belfast Optic and this is Victoria Channel and this notice board and that's the, uh, the Titanic Slipways and that's obviously Titanic Exhibition Centre and this notice board here gives you all the information about Victoria Wharf and uh, Queen's Island and the shipbuilding industry and it sums it up pretty well here so that's why I'm going to video this. The end of the 19th century shipbuilding was dominant industry in uh, Belfast. Harlan Wolf. 176 ships built in, at the port uh, in the first decade of the 20th century. Uh, totaling 1,300,000 tonnes and in 1912 alone 200,000 tonnes were launched. When uh, Thompson Graving Dock opened in 1911 it was the largest graving dock in the world and the only one capable of holding the Olympic class liners Olympic, Titanic and Britannic. And then there's some information about the pump house. And today Alexander Graving Dock is home of HMS Caroline, the classi a classic example of First World War cruiser and the second oldest commissioned warship in the Royal Navy, the oldest being HMS Victory. And she took part in the Battle of Jutland and I've done videos on her. And it's talking about Samson and Goliath. You are now. Talking about the Blink sculpture, I, I don't think I've ever seen that. I don't know. 